Hi everyone, slightly impromptu video. I didn't bring any filming equipment uh, back home with me to the rural north, uh, so my phone camera will have to do. But just given the slightly unusual circumstances this Christmas, I thought I would film this little video. I've just been joined by my cat who's decided that he wants to make an appearance. But this is just going to be short and sweet, hopefully. The first thing to say, obviously, is I hope that everyone is having a very wonderful and festive Christmas, if indeed you're celebrating, and if you're not, uh, I hope that you're having an excellent day and staying safe otherwise. And for those of you that are working, as I know many of my uh, medical student colleagues are, um, not just in the NHS, but in care work and delivery services and the emergency services and so on, um, everyone that is just unable to, to be with their families owing to the COVID situation, for what it's worth, my very deepest sympathies. I'm immensely grateful that I've been able to see my family this Christmas. In my own case, this is the second time that I've managed to go home um, this year, since actually last Christmas. So I was able to make it home uh, in September very briefly for literally two or three days. Um, so I've really not been able to spend that much time with my family this year owing to the, the coronavirus situation and people shielding and so on. And certainly if I think this year has taught us potentially one thing other than wear a mask, it's um, be grateful that your family is kind of well and safe and that you're able to see them. Because obviously as circumstances may be, that uh, may not always be so easy. But I have been very lucky and received some very wonderful presents from my brothers. Um, had some wonderful drawing stuff, so nice drawing new mechanical pencil and some fine liners for doing uh, for doing artwork, so I'll do some anatomy stuff with those, very much looking forward to trying these. Received a couple of books, so we've got Critical by Dr Matt Morgan, I believe that's about intensive care in ITU, and uh, Dear NHS, which is this collection of stories from um, celebrities edited, put together by Adam Kay. So I'm very much looking forward to reading those. Forgive the slightly shaky camera, but Max has just very much made himself at home and I'm having to stretch to pick up everything. Oh, and then finally, I might just have to show you this enough chocolate to um, to put down Johnny Vegas. And of course, not to mention this extremely wonderful and very warm and comfortable hoodie from my very lovely girlfriend. So really, I've done quite well this Christmas. But that's it guys, just wanted to wish you all well. Thank you so much for the insane amounts of support uh, that the channel has had this year and the website and all the rest of it. It's just grown leaps and bounds faster than I was expecting. You guys have been absolutely wonderful and I hope if you've been able to that you have had the wonderful Christmases that, that you all deserve. Take care and I will see you hopefully at some point in the new year.